also going to continue with more of the um, movie um, reviews. Um, so I got so many, man. I got, I think I got like hundreds of wrestling movies, like so many. Anyways, um, like yeah, because I I didn't do do any for quite a while. Like the other day, I didn't do any reviews on that on any you know. So thinking about that, and I thought yeah, well you know I thought I might as well um do that um so to keep you know so I didn't do any for a while. So I'm gonna try to you know I'm gonna do three for today. Um, so anyways, today I'm gonna be talking about. Uh, WWF Over the Edge, um, 1998. Um, I think this was from, oh, geez, um, April, May of 98. Um, so, this here's a three, eight, three hours. Um, so it says, you know, the most controversial, controversial match of the year. Um, but you can see there. Um, so, uh, this match here has, um, is a great one. It has, uh, starts up, no, it has a bonus match, which was just, yeah, um, which was a light heavyweight champion, uh, Taka Michinoku and Bradshaw versus Kai and Tai with yamaguchi son. um, so that that was a match there. That was something because Bradshaw's like this six foot, what is it, six foot six, six seven, you know, about two hundred and eighty pounds, almost three hundred pounds, a big guy, to teaming up with I talk Michinoku, who is which is about five foot six, five seven, one seventy maybe fifty or something like that against Kai and Tai, which uh, these other wrestlers are like. Um, I'm gonna put it. They're both the same height, five six, five seven. Um, not very big guys. So it was quite weird, you know, seeing this tall, big, you know. Um. Anyways, um, but then yeah, that that was an interesting match there. Um. Then there was mask, mask versus mask. Um. Vader against uh, Kane. Um. That one there was quite of an interesting uh, match there. Vader against Kane, um, and this here I think would be Vader's last, I think, yeah, I think it was his last match with the uh, WWF, um, I think that was the last one in my, um, after that is, um, LOD 2000 with Draws and Sonny versus Skull 8-Ball with Chains, um, that there was quite of an interest, interesting match. Um, Hawk and Animal. Um, against, you know, Skull, Eight Ball, which is, they were known as on this Disciples of Apocalypse. Um, that there was quite of an interesting match there. Um, really good. Um, and then there was a match, special challenge match, which was um, Sable attempts to win a freedom from um, marvelous Mark Miro. So, when that match there, if 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 she wins, um, then um, then yeah, it says about you know wins her freedom, so she doesn't have to list. You know, she goes on her own. Um, but if she loses, if she loses the match, um, then I think she's out of the uh, WWF. Um, and I think, you know, out of the WWF, um, if she loses. Um, and after that is, and then there's a six-man tag team war, which is D-Generation X, Triple H, and the New Age Outlaws, which is, uh, which is Billy Gunn in the Road Dog, versus The Nation, which, um, is Owen Hart, Kama, and D'Lo Brown. So around that time, you know, 98 something, that's when Owen Hart joined um, the Nation of Domination there. Um, and then after there's a, there's a intercontinental title match, um, Champion The Rock 
versus Farouk. So around this time, I think Farouk, I don't know, he might have been out of the nation around that time. Um, but that there was quite of an interesting match there. Um, very interesting. And then um, there's the, which I would say, you know, which was, the, like I said, the match, controversial match of the year, the most controversial show match of the year. Um, so um, this here is the championship match, which is the champion Stone Cold Steve Austin versus Dude Love um, with with special referee Mr. McMahon. Um, special timekeeper is Mr. Bish Briscoe. And um, special ring announcer, um, Pat Patterson, uh, Mr. Patterson. So that, that there, you could tell, because that there, it was pretty much um, four against one, really, you know, in this match. Um, so that's why this man had, you know, decided to be the special referee and, you know, um... That's why, you know, he decided to be the referee for this one. <laughs> um, and then, you know, the, spot, the timekeeper and the special ring announce. So he had all of them, four, you know, on his, well, three of them on Vince McMahon's side, you know, or, well, I should, I should say four of them on Dude Love's side. So it's kind of like, you know, but, um, no, it was quite an interesting match there. Um, there's some matches there. But yeah, there's great, 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 great um, pay-per-view. Um, but yeah, there's quite a bit of matches. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, well, seven matches. Um, great, great, great pay-per-view. Really good. Um, so, hit that thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe. Um, all you people that did so far, thank you very much for that one. Greatly appreciate it. So yeah, this for, you know, any wrestling fan out there would definitely, definitely, definitely um, enjoy these. Um, so I used to do it every now and then. Um, so hope you liked it. Um, so I'm going to do one more and stay tuned for that. I'll be right back.